Okay, so I think I see Jeff right here. Okay. So he's going Jeffrey. Hi. How are you? Hey. Didn't expect to see you here. I did not. I, I was just, you know, fixing my vest. Yeah. Yeah. You just got finished doing C today, and obviously this is your last performance. So obviously a goodbye Q and A is ready to happen. I love publicity. So, I know. I love okay. exposure. I know. How old were you when you first started theater, and what's your favorite musical? I first started theater when I was three. Well, I started dancing when I was three, and then theater when I was in third grade, second grade. And then my favorite musical that I've done, or just ever? Um, ever. My favorite musical ever is probably a musical called The Light in the Piazza, which is kind of a strange choice for me. Anyway, I think Morgan likes that one, too. Morgan loves that one. Yeah. And, um, all right, so how did uh, Eileen become a thing? Eileen, my, fr my roommate Emily had a practice puppet that we named Eileen, and I loved it so much that I bought my own from the Brooklyn Puppet Conspiracy, I think is what they're called. Wow. The company. That sounds very interesting. So, what plans do you have once you get back to the city? Once I get back to New York, I'm going to uh, hit up all the rich people I know for free dinners. Um, I'm going to call Telsey and company and try and get some appointments. And then I'm gonna see some Broadway shows, see some old friends. Have you seen Hamilton? Hamilton, yes. I have seen that. It's very good. Alright. Are you sure it's good? I love it. <laughs> Alright, what is your favorite spot and memory on tour so far? Favorite stop is Chicago. Love Chicago. Chicago was very, very good. That was one of my favorite stops. I love Chicago and my favorite memory. Hmm. Just the one you're having right now. Probably um me. probably um when we did the El Capitan performance in Los Angeles for all the Newsy fans. That was, uh, yeah, that was really special. Cool. Yeah. We got to meet a lot of cool people. Mm -hmm. And with Kenny Ortega as well. I was there. Movie director. So that was very, very cool for me as well. All right, so this one is actually from Andrew. I'll let Andrew do this one. Okay. The Eugene O'Neill Theater must hold a special place in your heart because that's where you made your Broadway debut, mm -hmm. correct? And that's the first time you've ever seen a Broadway show, right? Yeah. And so, how was how that? Oh, it was so fun. So I saw Spring Awakening there when I was um, when I was a freshman in high school. That was my first trip to New York. And then five years later, that's where I made my Broadway debut. I can't believe it. What was your Broadway debut? The Book of Mormon. The Book of Mormon. Mm -hmm. Eugene O'Neill Theater, 49th oh my Street. God. Broadway official. Very special, very weird. Going through the, it seems much smaller now that I'm a bigger person. Than yeah. 14 year old. Do you have any uh, advice for people trying to achieve the same dream as you? Hmm. Don't be afraid to look like an idiot, because you will. Don't be afraid to take risks. Don't be, if, don't be neglectful of anything. Don't think that you sh don't need to know how to tap dance, or you shouldn't take a singing lesson, or you don't need to know gymnastics. Like, all of this stuff, if you want to do it, go for it all the way. and. And really commit and don't be scared because people get really scared too easily and it's just scary. Just yeah. So, last question, last question before we go back here. My favorite question of all time. How do you feel about Jordan Samuels? Jordan Samuels is a liar and a filthy cheat. He stole money from me back in San Antonio and he still owes me. That's what I have to say. But actually, I love Jordan Samuels. He's my favorite, sweetest little newsie. Um, he's very kind and gentle, and he teaches me a lot about Japanese culture and video games. And he has the best smile in the whole world. Oh my gosh, thank you. I think I'm blessing, but you can't really see. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Jeff. Thank you so much. It's been a pleasure having you around New Square for over a year now. And I'm going to miss you a lot. So with the fansies and everyone else here in Music Square. And we wish you all the best. Thank you. Thank you. High five. Love you. you.